fireplace where Harold hangs out? Uh, he's on the top floor here. But very important fireplace. Tell me about the fireplace. I know you don't. Well, the, fire, the fireplace was part of a larger room that was occupied by the manager of the railways. He used to board here back in the old days when the hotel, when it was a hotel for a start. Yes. But when they had rooms up the top. So, important man at the railway, workshops, he had a fireplace. And it was It was own. His own fireplace. His own fireplace. Wish I had. And it still works today. And I haven't even got my own chair. Home the dog steals my chair. So for a bloke to have his own. Now we are at the Gents Leagues Club. We're upstairs now. That means that downstairs you've got beer. Uh, and it's cold. Let's go. that were sent to me, Sverdlovs, um, where immigrants came to Australia, made a life for themselves, and they set up a, uh, a, a shop in there, and it was basically a shop, then it became a, a fish and chip shop. But um, I've got a, a great image of an old uh, 42 Ford take, has hit, hit something and taken out the, um, the awning. Try it off. Hey, that is my favourite colour. I know. How did you know? Jacko's just been next door to try and pair a lime green shoes. Now, we are desperate for something to go with it. What do you got? <laughs> it's a bit short, Jacko. A bit short? You said it was. Couldn't see my legs. Fashion emergency. That's what we said. It is. It is a fashion emergency. <laughs> Righto, Jacko. We've been shopping. We've checked out that huge burger. It's massive. And the shake. The, the shake. shake. The shake, yeah. Well, I'm still feeling just a little bit like I need a little bit more. Are you serious? Yeah, well, I want to get to the size of you. <laughs> Thank you very so much. So we can be brothers in arms. <laughs> All right, so you're asking me if you were well, staying in Ipswich. If you're staying in Ipswich, I know there's a lot of good eateries. Well, all right. Because you've got Fourth Child. Fourth Child is absolutely amazing. It is. Um, I would have to tip my hat to the Indian Meefell. Yep. Um, I, you, Nothing like a curry in a hurry. <laughs> yeah. Um, got to got to give uh, Woodlands and Marburg a special mention. They've got a cafe out there that, and I'm an absolute fan. Woodlands at Marburg, check it out. Um, actually, we'll put the link up. How's that sound? Yeah, it is. Um, uh, uh, it's picturesque out there too. It's worth a drive. Just and to right up your alley, the a ton of history and yeah. absolute epic scenery. And they've got ghosts. They've got ghosts. It's, and you love your ghost. I love my ghost. Love your ghost. Yep. What about um, pizza? Yeah, yeah, pizza's okay, I've got to, yeah. I've got to tell you, there's yeah. a guy just out of town, yeah. uh, well, just out in the suburbs, mozzarella fella. Oh, mozzarella fella. Mozzarella fella. He's a whiz. He's yeah. an absolute whiz on the pizzas. So you have got to check it out. Now, of course, if you were still hungry after all the pizza and all the Indian and all of the wonderful food that you could get, there, yeah, don't forget that don't forget you can get a meal at the Ipswich Central Hotel. Yep. Also, there's the Chance Leagues Club. Why didn't I think of that? Let's go. 